whatever. So then he walked out and he was like, I have a date tonight with this woman because you've been out with this boy. And I was like, wrong information. You need to stop. Okay. Um, and so he goes to the thing with the girl. He's like, I'm going to have sex with so many people because, you know, I need to get her out of my system. And then he goes and to the party and they take pictures and he didn't do anything because he couldn't do it because he loves her. And he just now figured it out, stupid boy. He just now figured it out, 79%. He was like, I love her. I didn't know. And I was like, really? You didn't know? Oh, well, stupid. Um, <laughs> and so she's back home because he left. And she's like, okay, I'm leaving. So then she went back home. And she's like up in her room sulking. And she's like, I'm pregnant. I don't know what to do. Like, I'm so stressed out. Um, and her dad, like, doesn't even care about her at all. He only cares about his business. So, like, he doesn't even care if she dies or not. Like, literally, that's what it is. Okay. Um, and I was just, like, stressed. I don't even know. Um, and then, let's see. Then, oh, he comes back because he figures out that she's pregnant. And he talks to Mrs. Sterling. And Mrs. Sterling is like, you're stupid. She loves you. You need to go and find her and, like, be with her. And then Mrs. Sterling shows up. And she's, like, talking to the girl. And she's, like, doing the same thing. And she tells her, it's my favorite part. She tells her he forgives because, you know, she's like, he's not going to forgive me for kissing Angelo because blah, 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 whatever. And so she's like, he forgives because I was his mom, his biological mom. And they hired me so that we could be close together and we choose a new name and like all this stuff. And I was like, oh, I'm his mom. We love that. She's so cute and she reads romance books and she eats jobs and I was like, that's gonna be me when I'm like 65. It's gonna be great, guys. It's gonna be wonderful. Um, so I just love her so much. She's my favorite character in the whole entire world. Um, actually not true because I have a lot of favorite characters, but she's like up there, you know. Um, so she got them back together and he finally gets up to the house and he's like, I need your daughter back. And he was like, mm, you really need my daughter back? Beg for her. And he never begs. He's like, I don't negotiate. I don't beg. I don't love. And I was like, liar, liar, liar. Pants on fire, okay? <laughs> I know I have six fingers, but you know, there. Um, <laughs> I mean, I have six fingers, but not on this hand, you know? Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. So, so then he begs for her because he loves her. He's like, okay, fine, I'll do it. And she's eavesdropping the whole time. She's like, oh my god, he actually loves me. He's begging for me. Like, oh my god. And I was like, see me now. Um, and so then she passes out because she has not been eating. And he's there. And he's like, I'm so sorry, blah, blah, blah. And he's like, I want to raise this baby with you because I love you. And she's like, you love me. And I was like, oh, yes, she loves you. That's so cute. And then... Like, it goes to five years later, they had a baby, and oh, in the beginning, she was like, he's like, I bet you already picked out the names for the, for you and Angela's babies, right? And she said, yeah, Joshua and Emmeline. Guess what they named their babies? Joshua and Emmeline. Okay? Um, Joshua, Joshua, Romeo, he and, yeah, Romeo is his brother, and I was like, oh my god, so cute. So that was her second baby, the first one is Emmeline right and then like it was five years after that he became president and there he's like the only thing that matters more than my presidency is my wife and i was like we love character development we just love it it's so okay that's about it all right Woo Good review. Was what great. is it called uh the kiss thief it was nasty don't read it <laughs> <laughs>